Hey guys, welcome back to another video in my restaurant on my channel. And I don't know if you've seen uh, number two of Avatar, Avatar The Way of Water, but it's a really cool movie. You should go check it out. Warning, if you're like a little kid or you have little kids, it's a three hour and ten minute long movie. So anyway, I got a figure from Avatar. It just came. So we're going to unbox it. Okay. I've been waiting for this a long time to come. Okay, not such a long time, just a week. <laughs> but, um, okay, some papers. Okay. And just a little warning, I'm definitely going to be butchering these names. Uh, so don't just oh this is so cool but it is pretty small so this is what it looks like uh, it has a black light try me cool so uh, Elu is the big creature here and the Tam is the avatar the writer so let's get let's dive into it this is what the back looks like. Black light glow. The Metcaina Reef House uh, Reef. Just that's what I meant. If you don't know uh, how to like put where everything goes, then you have a little reference thing. World of Pandora. The uh, Tay of an Elu Avatar. The Way of Water. Try me. Then that's the thing I showed black light and then at the end of the video we're gonna go somewhere where it's dark and we're gonna try the black light glow so let's open it i do think the amount of money i spent on this is quite a lot for its size but it is really cool i'm guessing it's just because of the black light that's in there This oh god, I'm probably gonna need a knife here. There we go. Okay. Wow. Let's get this out. What it looks like manual who needs the manual okay i'll probably gonna need the manual okay let's take a look at the manual probably just had to put berries in or something yeah was right okay batteries and try me but where everything goes okay so first let's get the plant out we have this i'm guessing it's gonna be bioluminescent it's gonna glow in the black light. That plant we have. We have another plant that I'm guessing is gonna be the same. Take that out of the way. Okay, now my f least favorite part using scissors. Because of the rubber bands. Oh, just here. Okay, I'll get back to you when it's done, because it's probably going to take a long time. Okay, so I got Elu out of the packaging. Pretty cool. It's really cute. There's a lot of details, actually. I'm going to try the black light later. There we go. So, so far we have these two plants out, and Elu. The flippers are rubbery. The whole thing's kind of a, like, softer, kind of plastic material. These kind of connecting to make the Hilu bond thing. Okay. And then we have, like, a little hole at the end for the stand. Okay. Now let's get the whole stand out. There we go. Oh, well, that was pretty easy. Oh, so... 
I've been watching reviews on this, and the I figured out that it said that these there's like a mode on is the black light is on nonstop, off is basically you know off even when you press the button, and try me mode is it's gonna shine when you press the button. Okay, so let's switch it off for now. Okay, two more things to get out: the stand and the tam. Uh, okay. Come on, get out. This, this. Oh shoot! Probably gonna have to. Okay, this is pretty complicated. I'll get the tame out first. Okay, well I'm gonna cut it out and get back to you. Okay, I wanted to keep the box, but I had to tear it to get the tail out. This is what he looks like. Pretty cool. So now let's put it together. So let's take the stand. Uh, I'm really going to need the box. Where's the box? Where'd I put the box? Here. Uh, so, it's like this. This thing goes... Here, out. Oh, it's pretty sharp. Okay, then this thing goes up here. Ow, it's so sharp. Okay, then this thing, the stand, goes through here. Okay, then the elu goes. Onto that, and the tab uh, goes like this, maybe. Okay. Let's see if it okay holds on. Fine. Okay, I'm not really. I guess it goes like this. It's pretty cool. Uh, okay, so now let's get into the review. Okay, so first let's take the tam. He has articulation at his both his hands. No, no articulation at the head. Articulation at the thighs, the legs, like that. Wait, does he have to? Oh, well, okay, at the head he has, like, seriously really, really little articulation. Both legs have articulation. The tail is just, like, soft plastic, no articulation there. His hair is soft plastic. The clothes. Oh, and he has articulation at his waist, too. That's pretty cool. Okay, well, I guess we can all agree that the tail is pretty cool. Okay, now let's get to the elu. There we go. This, I'm guessing, can go underwater. It doesn't have any articulation. It's just the flippers are made of soft plastic. All three sets of flippers. These things to make the helu the bond. Are uh, soft plastic. The head near the neck, it's soft plastic. That's basically, but the coloring is so cool. It's really nice. Okay, so that's basically it. Then we have this. Okay, let's try the plants. Yeah, the plants are bioluminescent. I don't know if I'm even saying it right. I think that only applies for algae or whatever. Anyway, so this is basically a coral reef. Uh, oh, and an elu is basically the dire horse of uh, the Metcaina tribe, the Pandora. Basically the dire horse of Pandora. Or whatever. I, I don't even know if I'm saying it right, but it's definitely the dire horse or something. So let's put the tame on the elu. 
Okay, so that's what it looks like. You can pose it down, sides, like that. It's the Elu is really looks really similar to Plesiosaur in so many ways, like that. Okay, now let's go and try the bioluminescent thing. I need to find a dark space, which is downstairs, so let's go. Okay, I think we can all agree it's pretty dark in here. So, let's take the tam off the glue, glue off the stand. Hope it's on try me. No. Okay. Plant bioluminescent. Like I said, there's like green the bi there's like green bioluminescent stuff. This plant at the top isn't pretty bioluminescent, I'm guessing. It's all pretty cool, but no. The thing we were all waiting for is the elu bioluminescent thing. Okay. 